No win here at Livingston and into the next round into the quarterfinals of the Scottish Cup. Uh, you must be absolutely delighted after that one. It's a nice ring to it. Just you even saying it to me in the quarterfinals. Um, a lot of people thought we'd just stand aside because um, of the opportunity that came our way. But my word, I thought, in fact, since I've been here, that's the best all round performance. We've had some big results, we've had some great results. But in terms of performance and carrying out the game plan and being absolutely ruthless, my team from you know the goalkeeper to the forwards to my subs were exceptional. I could go on all night. It's, it was the best performance since I've been here. Like you said, to a man, every single player, um, absolutely fantastic today and just it must be so pleasing to see that out on the pitch. Knew their jobs uh, and then I, I just asked them to be brave before the game on the ball because I knew we could we could spook them. We could we could hurt Livingston if we really believed, and I thought we did to an extent first half, but I thought we were even better second half when we got the ball, we broke, we made the right pass, and we got the goals at brilliant times. And then we we looked quite comfortable in the game. I'm always biting my fingernails because I'm thinking, oh well, if they get an equaliser or they get a goal back, could be you know squeaky bum time to be honest with you. But I was so comfortable throughout the game. I was I really trusted my players today, and I thought. I just sat down a few times because I was enjoying their performance. And against a team that's, you know, four, I think fourth in the Premiership, the, to come to a venue like this also give us such confidence going into the rest of the season as well. I'm hoping, I'm hoping so. It should, and it, I'm, I'm sure it will, because that's twice we've come here, we've won. We can, we can prove that we can do it. We have to be more consistent. Yeah, we lost a lot of players, but I'd like a bit of consistency because we are a good team. When you see today that we've got a bit of everything. Um, some teams are going to sit in on us, some teams are going to um, come and press us. We've got to find ways to handle that. And I thought today we did when Livingston tried to get in our faces. We were brave, passed the ball and got brilliant goals. So um, we've got to do more of that between now and the end of the season. And uh, Billy Mackay, uh, hot on <laughs> getting that manager, uh, player of the month. Um, two ridiculous finishes he, today. He said to me, he said to me that I've never scored as good a goals <laughs> as that. I want Billy to enjoy his football. I've pulled him in. Billy um, is a brilliant goal scorer, but there's so much more to him, and I've told him that. Sometimes Billy will get a goal and he'll think, mm, right, okay. He doesn't think it's, I've done enough. He just, he just thought, well, well, one goal. Billy, his all-round performance recently. And I said the goals would come if he got it right. His all-round performance was nothing short of amazing. And and, and I know we're individualising here because he scored two great goals because my team were brilliant, but I told him the goals would come if the performance levels was like that. And they have. And I'm, I'm just delighted for him. Delighted with him. Delighted for him. He's our only out-and-out striker just now. We've got Ozzy Samuels coming back soon. But what a player he's been over the last couple of months, yeah. years, yeah. goal scoring, but I think he's becoming even better with age, he's like a fine wine. Yeah, and um, he didn't make it onto the pitch, but Robbie D, it's good to see him back in uh, the squad as well, and a good moment for him to come back in. Yeah, well. and I could have given him five, ten minutes, but well, it gives him, when the game was done, it gives him another week to work, and uh, I think everybody at this football club is absolutely delighted to see Robbie D's even back on the bench. It gave us all a lift today, and other injured boys coming back as well, so looking forward to that. Really, thank you very much for that. Cheers. Thanks, Liam.